Pocky Watch. They see the way that I'm moving, they hit it. Cause Daddy Pie, keep a chopping on you. I was a young boy, but up in that bitch. Just like Dennis Rodman, swear they couldn't stop me. Chopper gon' sing in this time. Welcome back you to another video of type of the time man. You already know what we are gonna be doing, but we're doing a story time. Look though, you know what I'm saying? Let's get right into this. We're doing a story time on the first time I used Royal Honey. Man, y'all don't know what this is, bro. This, for a lot of y'all, majority of y'all, this is gonna save your life. You know what I'm saying? This is gonna save your life, bro. This is going to make you have more energy, last long, and not tap out, yo. This is gonna make you do your thing. Let me give you your thing. Listen up. I'm gonna do certain time how I first, the first time I actually used this. The f I don't know, when did I first time I used this shit, bro? I gotta really think about it. Uh, the first time, ah, the first time I used this probably was in like, Shit, like 2021, 2020. Like it was around then, right? And I was at a party. Da -da -da, I'm getting lit, such and such. I'm drinking, doing whatever, right? Mind you, I'm drunk. When you're drunk and you about to you feel, participate in sexual activities, you the the sex when you're drunk is is fake, you know, lit, you know what I'm saying? Because you be so drunk or you or you be so like lit that you don't even realize like you going crazy right now because you be so lit. You feel what I'm saying? When you take this while you're drunk, it adds a little bit more spice to it. You feel me? You feel what I'm saying? Now, no too many girls that use this. I never met a girl that used this shit. I only really meet guys who use this. The other one's called Bo. I only really know guys who use this shit. But basically, I put this in a liquor bottle and it was a personal bottle and I was just drinking it. Like I was just drinking it. I was chilling the whole the whole night, you know what I'm saying? The whole night. So I had two of them too. So when the girl, you feel me, when it's time for me to go, you know, when show you or whatever, I was already off of there. Shit was already in my system. So my shit was already brick. You know what I'm saying? It was already hard. I was ready I was ready, right? So, you know, we get in the room, we talking, whatever that, right? We we macking and macking it. It's already sauce time, you know what I'm saying? I've been had shit planned out, you know what I'm saying? I always have shit planned out when I use this honey shit, bro. You gotta have it planned out, bro, because you don't wanna take this shit and knowing you not finna get no cat and your dick gonna be hard, bro. Hard as fuck for no reason, bro. You could be in a, a room full of your mans, bro, full of your friends. And your shit on brick. You feel me? So plan on using this. Make sure you is guaranteed you're getting some cat. Cause you do not want to be that guy whose dick is just hard and you run you run a bunch of niggas. Cause that's gonna look mad crazy. You think it take a right percentage because yo, I don't know if you guys don't read. I usually read shit before I take things. And um it take it says take Take one satchel, 20 grams every two days as needed, right? Two days as needed. That does not mean to take the whole package in one day. Because your dick is going to be hard for like three days, bro. Three, four, bro. I'm telling you, bro, because I know this shit, bro. I know this shit, bro. And that shit does not feel good, bro. Like, I'm sure you fellas know it's not feel comfortable to roll over and knowing your shit brick hard and... It's not comfortable to sleep, you feel me? You you know, bro, this shit is just not comfortable, you feel what I'm saying? So just take, be responsible when you take this shit, bro. Like, don't be that dickhead who 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 wanna, you feel me, take the whole thing, bro. Cause I did that so many times, bro. And I ain't, it took me a while to catch on to why my shit was moving like that, bro. Cause I was not being responsible with it. But back to what I was talking about. So I take the honey, whatever, right? And, um... I had it in my liquor bottle, drinking it, drinking it, drinking it. Like I said, I wasn't being responsible at the time, so I had another package. I'm thinking the honey shit not kicking in because you feel my shit was, you feel me? It wasn't, it wasn't there. So I took it straight, I took it raw, mm, just like quick little, you feel me? And um, bro, after that, my shit was, I was, my shit was hard, bro. And you feel me? I'm doing my thing, bro. We probably, we probably did it for like. 
for like five hours, bro. Like literally, it was like it probably probably was going for like five hours, bro. You feel me saying? Cause mind you, I'm drunk as hell. I got I got the pen, I got the honey in my system through the drink and through me just sipping it straight out the package. And my shit was my shit was on go. Yo. I was on go that whole fucking time. Mind you, I, I spent the night with Shorty. So when I woke up that morning, my shit was still brick. You feel me? It was still hard, bro. And I did not know what was going on. I did not know what was going on, yo. I did not know. I just want the fuck. You know what I'm saying? I just want this shit to just, I'm thinking like if I just keep fucking it, it might go away. No, bro. Like, that's not the case, bro. Like, this shit literally, it literally tells you, bro, it's going to take a while, bro. That's why it says take every two days as needed. You feel what I'm saying? I did not do that. I took the whole shit, bro. And my shit was on go for like a whole 72 hours, bro. Like, literally that whole week, my shit was on raw. Like, my shit was still hard every single day I wake up, bro. And that's why I don't really go crazy with these shits, bro. But these shits is definitely A1. Like, these shits get the job done. Is it healthy? No, I don't think it's healthy for real to take these shits, bro. I'm not gonna lie, I don't think this shit's healthy. Like, I think it fucks up your, your sperm or some shit like that. But it's definitely not healthy. Um, It's technically, it's Viagra in a, in a such funny form. But uh, I wouldn't take this a lot. It's definitely not healthy, you feel what I'm saying? But it gets the job done, though. You feel what I'm saying? It, the, the job gets done A1. A <laughs> you feel what I'm saying? So if you ever... You got a date, you ever got a link, you got a girlfriend, and you want to step it up a notch. Yes, sir, ski. Yes, sir, ski. Yes. Cop one of these. These are usually available at a gas station, at a liquor store, a local liquor store, a local gas station. And do what you got to do, bro. Run it up. Go crazy. That is my story time of when I first used this package. Um... You feel what I'm saying? For a lot of you niggas who, who nut and want to tap out, you know what I'm saying? Don't let your girl finish. This will make sure your girl finishes, bro. You always want, bro, yeah, bro, listen, man to man shit, bro. If you doing the whoop the whoop the bouncy bounce, make sure who you are having sex with has finishes or has a, um, damn, what's that word? Finishes, bro. Every trip, bro. I'm telling you, bro, those group chats be crazy. Girls be crazy, they'll come back to you. Oh, your dick was lame anyway. Da, da, da. Now, when you know she, you feel me, you did what you had to do, you can look at her like this. Really? Was it really? Was it really? Because you, yeah, let's not do that. You feel what I'm saying? So always make sure your girl always finishes, bro. You know what I'm saying? Make sure she taps out. You better make sure she nuts before you nut. That's all I'm saying, bro. Make sure she, she nuts before you nut. Because if you nut before she nuts, we all know your your little bitch ass is not going to get back in there. You want to tap out, go roll up, go smoke a blunt, go watch some TV like a weirdo, and not get back in there and finish the job. You know what I'm saying? I had those moments. You know what I'm saying? That's why I had to step it up a notch. You know what I'm saying? So let's not do that no more, fellas. You know what I'm saying? If you're watching this, make sure you like, comment, subscribe to the channel, man. One of the 3K. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace. Had to hit it one time, then pass the ass to the crew. Uh, freak ass, be booty do. Uh, shoot, shoot. Yeah. Bitch, I'm not fucking with you. No. She stuck to me just like some glue. Bitch, I'm cold just like the flu. Blue. Bitch, I'm in my country, boy.